Welcome back. Now, the Congress party may announce today whether it will field a wrestler Vinish Pogat in the upcoming Haryana Assembly elections or not. Now, this came after a meeting of the AICC Central Election Committee, where the AICC in charge of Haryana, Deepak Babaria, revealed that the party's candidates list for Haryana will be released within two days. He also added that the party will clarify about Olympian wrestler Vinish Pogat today whether she will fight the Haryana Assembly election on a Congress ticket or not. Vinesh Pugat, an Olympian who recently retired from wrestling after being disqualified at the Paris Olympic, has been the subject of speculation regarding her political future. Her cousin, Babita Pugat, is already a BJP MLA, finding further interest in her potential political move. Well, as far as the Haryana Assembly elections are concerned, all eyes are waiting with bated breath to see whether at all Vinish Pogat is going to make a foray into the political sphere, just like her cousin Babita Pogat did, but from and she's going to contest elections on a Congress ticket or not, that decision may have, uh, may be declared today itself. My colleague Niyamika is joining me on the phone line to get us more details. And Niyamika, a lot of suspense surrounding Vinish Pogat's uh, candidature, of course, the Congress party leader are not making bones about it at all. Uh, we have seen how Dipinder Hudda has time and again rendered all support to Vinesh Pogat and the restless fraternity. But now, of course, Deepak Babari also says that the Congress is open to a uh, wide ticket to Vinesh Pogat. Well, indeed, and uh, that's the only reason why uh, we have also been told uh, by the sources within the Congress party that uh, uh, the Congress party's member of parliament, Mr. Dipinder Singh Hudda, held uh, separate talks with Congress leader Rahul Gandhi. In fact, uh, uh, there was uh, a decision that needs to be taken yesterday only. However, the Congress High Command has asked Dipinder Singh Hooda to clarify the stand of Vinesh Pogat because as of now, there is no confirmation which has come on the part of Vinesh Pogat regarding her candidature in the upcoming assembly elections. And that's the only reason why uh, today itself it, uh, it can be decided that whether she is going to contest the upcoming polls or not. As uh, uh, for Vinesh Pogat, there are two seats which have been offered to her, which uh, includes uh, Charki Dadri as, well as uh, Julana. As uh, uh, these are the two seats uh, where uh, uh, the name of Vinesh Pogat is getting considered. However, it is not going to be that easy for the Congress party because uh, on the seat of Charki Dadri, there are other two uh, two uh, uh, two uh, uh, people who are uh, uh, trying to you know stake claim over this particular seat. Whether it is about uh, Ajit Singh Pogat, who has already started making Meaning, uh, within this uh, particular seat. On the other side, uh, it is uh, uh, it is uh, Somvir Sangwan who is also staking claim over this entire uh, seat. As, uh, he is saying that if the Congress party will not give him ticket, then he might also contest as an independent candidate. So that's what uh, the other uh, challenges which is before the Congress party regarding this entire issue. However, it will be interesting to see whether Vinesh Pogat will agree to enter in, uh, into politics or not because of now she has continuously saying that she is not ready and she will make her decision very soon and uh, today itself there is uh, going to be a congress cec meeting right. after six in which this decision is going to be taken absolutely niyamika we all are going to be looking towards to see whether at all the cec meeting today is going to declare should one of its candidates contesting elections for haryana or not as of now the ball is in Vinicius' court to decide whether she wants to make a foray into haryana elections just yet well thank you for details we shall leave it at that for the moment